My name is Katie Service. I'm the airport manager, and with me today is John Griffin, the airport commission chair, as well as up on the balcony, Matt Ilya, the assistant airport manager. So I want to thank you for being here. Um, as part of our overall 2018 airport business plan, we identified four major goals for the airport with a number of objectives. And within those goals, they were maximizing general aviation activity at the airport, diversifying our revenue stream so that we have both aviation and non-aviation revenue sources, becoming a regional air transportation leader, and enhancing the airport image and the airport brand. So with a new year becomes a new name. This puts us one step closer to reaching our goals. Why are we rebranding? The new name and logo were chosen after a year-long review of alternative names presented during the airport master plan visiting sessions, meetings with stakeholders, discussions with the airport commission, airport users, discussions with existing and potential new airline partners, and discussion with the town of Barnstable. The airport considered its overall objectives potential opportunities for, that a new name may afford, existing challenges that the airport is facing, and our local community in deciding to rebrand and deciding on a new name. The new name and logo were chosen not only to respond to passenger needs and expectations, but they were also chosen to prepare for potential airline partnerships, to align with the airport's commercial, future commercial um, service, to refocus the customer experience here on Cape Cod and to change the pr transportation perceptions for Cape Cod and the islands. We wanted to ensure that creating a new name would create a greater sense of place as we market the airport to travelers and users of our facility. Between July 2020 and October 2020, airport management met several times with our airport commission, which is a seven member board. We reviewed various contenders for a new name. We reviewed various logo changes, and the end result was approved by the Airport Commission in October of 2020. With that being said, I'd like to ask the Airport Commission Chair, John Griffin, to come up and say a few words. This is sort of bittersweet because it's the last time I'll welcome you to the Barnstable Municipal Airport. Got my old hat on. And this is, a, this is a bittersweet day, it's exciting, but just for the benefit of everybody, your airport is still here, only the name is changing, I got it, and our designator for the FAA is still HYA, aircraft will still hail, arriving and departing, Hyannis Tower. Your management team is unchanged. We have our professional, this is, the commission is sort of like the board of directors, but the people that run the show here is our professional management operations and maintenance team that is headed up by our airport manager, who you met, Katie. And I would like to, as I prepare to remove my old hat, for the direct your attention topside to our assistant airport manager, Matt Elia who will officially unveil the new name and the new logo of Cape Cod Gateway Airport. <laughs> 